Let's see what we're looking at up in Seoul with Jun Yoon. Good morning, Jun. Good morning, Adam. Uh, the Korean markets are also pointing to a lo another day of lo uh, losses on the Kospi this morning. But uh, we do have some major M&A news this morning. A follow-up uh, first on the Home Plus deal in Korea. Home Plus is UK-based retailer Tesco's Korea unit, and it's also the second biggest retail supermarket chain in Korea. Home Plus is also Tesco's biggest operation outside of the UK, and the deal is expected to be at around a seven trillion won. Uh, the bids closed yesterday, and US. SP uh, private equity fund Carlisle submitted a independent bid and another consortium, a consortium led by MBK Partners, a Korean PE fund, along with Korea's National Pension Service, a ca Canadian Pension Plan, and Singapore's Temasek, all together in one consortium, also submitted another bid. And the third consortium was KKR and Affinity Equity Partners, according to local reports. These three have uh, submitted their final bids as of yesterday, and this is expected to be one of the biggest deals in the retail sector this year. Also, another uh, deal that we are looking at, uh, Korea Development Bank has said that it has made a final decision to sell its holdings in KDB Daewoo Securities, KDB Asset Management, and also KDB Capital Corporation. This sale will be coming as soon as possible, according to KDB, and they will be selling all their stakes in all three companies. The 43% stake that they have in KDB Daewoo Securities is expected to be the biggest deal here. This is expected to be about a 4.2 trillion won deal because Daewoo is the second biggest brokerage house in Korea. Also, they own a 100% stake in KDB Asset Management and almost a 100% stake in KDB Capital as well. So I'll be watching uh, how the uh, these uh, deals progress and also I'll be watching for a reaction from Samsung Electronics which is trading at its lowest level in more than three years almost four years actually uh, it is at a uh, 1.05 a million mark uh, just barely uh, keeping its 1 million mark it was at 1 million back in 2012 so this is a very weak picture that we are seeing for Samsung they're expecting an open at 1.07 a million won this morning also overall we are expecting a lower picture uh, lower uh, open for the blue chips over, uh, generally and also we are seeing the COSDAQ according to pre-market bids expecting a slightly higher open after a steep sell-off in the past week. week. Matt, over to you.